congratulations, you're still here and going, which isn't easy, is it? No, it's it, it's it's a, it's a hard old business, but um, we are plugging away and we're having a we're on the middle of a great tour at the moment, 26 dates on the UK and. We've been uh, jetting off to far-flung places and um, just generally having a great time. Where's the other boys today, then? Oh, they're upstairs. They're, they're upstairs oh. doing doing the same for far lesser calibre radio stations well, than your own, I'm afraid. I'm very, very disappointed I must speak to the publicist about this. Well, I mean, I, I, well Alex, we, we're, sort of, we're sort of prepping you for an in-studio an in studio one. We're going to come up and see you in person soon. I just wonder whether Stephen and Jules would do a better interview, that's all. And, <laughs> you know, between the four of you, we'll get there in the end. You know, that's, <laughs> that's what I'm thinking. I always like meeting you, and I'll tell you why, because you can sing together. No point asking you two. I mean, I mean, it could all go very wrong, and then we'd know whose fault it was. But please, something before why don't you just play that and pretend could we would you mind we could save this whole thing just repeat an old interview really couldn't we um what's your life like ollie because as you know uh, the ladies just think you're delicious and it's fun being you isn't it really it, it, it's always fun being me don't you find it's fun being you as well Alex? no love i'm ginger on the uh, on the chunky side but that, that's that's funny that's funny in itself you've but got, it's not you've fun got, you've got to see the bright side particularly it's when you funny, look at your hair but not fun that's the difference <laughs> that's the difference you see what have you been doing i think we spoke about a year ago Humph, what's been happening? Can I call you Humph, by the yeah, way? Yeah, my, my mates call me Humph, so good. that's good. I don't want you to get to the hump in Humph. No, but, we, don't, um, we don't go there. That's far too personal. Good. What have you been doing the last year, then? What's been happening? Cool. Well, um, we've made the album. Um, so, together, which was the first... We actually we started Blake Records and uh, did our first project together, which was this album called Together, which has been absolutely amazing. We got um Brit nomination for it. We performed at the Classical Brits at the Albert Hall. Um, it's gone number one in Australia, number one in South Africa. Um, we've been to New York uh, where we uh, party with uh, Jennifer Hudson and uh, Blake Lively and uh, Lady Gaga and all sorts of people and uh, what else have we been doing getting ready for this tour this tour is kind of taking up lots of our life and tour, in between that yeah. dancing and champagne <laughs> you've got a great ability between you um, tell us a story for those who don't know how you all met well uh, yeah but pretty simple really I mean two of us have known each other since we were about eight years old um, Jules and I used to be choristers together so very old sort of old school classical training and then uh, Stephen was at uh, music college with me at Guildhall uh, Humph has joined us more recently and, uh, and was a uh, contact through our first producer um, and we, we sort of got together on, on, the, on, on the back of all that and found a first manager uh, looking through Facebook uh, as I recall and then uh, within about 36 hours got marched down to Universal Records and, and signed on the spot so uh, a pretty quick a quick sort of uh, start to the whole thing I but, mean for uh, those who don't really know much about us if you think of Il Devo for those who've heard of Il Devo we're the kind of better looking British version <laughs> absolutely that's how we like to think of ourselves yes. and can link a sentence as well that's a good thing about you <laughs> are those Il Devo still going by the way I used to have them on all the yeah. time but I don't yeah. hear anything of them these days really did you yeah no they are sort of around I think they just you know they got really big they make a you know disgusting amount of sort of footballer style money uh, from touring in Europe and, and they became very big in Europe and because they are more European and, and one mm. of them I know is from across the pond as well but you know we're all homegrown and, and it's, a, it's a smaller market over here it's a more intimate market and uh, you know it's, and we like that Well you're smart though you do all different types of song we're going to play two of my favourites in a minute there's With or Without You by you 2 at the one right. end there's Ness and Dormer at the other isn't there yeah. is that easy to cross the, the, the bridge of those different types of songs Yeah well, it, that's the, the reason we do it is because there are four, four singers you know we've got harmony got close harmony which means we can take on the most challenging songs to cover and uh, and create, uh, create our own versions of them and I think what's been really interesting doing the tour that we're doing at the moment is to see the reaction that we get back from an audience throughout mm. a concert where you do mm. an Essen Dormer and people are standing up and sort of cursing the football team and then uh, <laughs> and then we do with, with or without you and it's like being at a sort of um well, we, we tend to be rock stars for five minutes. <laughs> Stephen and Jules there now. Hello, boys. Hello. Hello. You all right? How's it going? Good. We were in the middle of something, but uh, we're here now. Whatever so. you were in the middle of, <laughs> yeah, it wasn't it as important as this programme. <laughs> and we thank you for it. Listen, uh, I just want to get to something. My producer, Kate, has been Googling, and uh, she does it regularly at the weekend. Um, and she, she put in Alex Belfield and Blake into Google, mm. and the most obscene things come up. Can we play that for the boys and get their comment on it? I just want to know why you feel this is appropriate to do this to me. Alex Belfield, he's a fatty. <laughs> Alex Belfield, he is fat and ginger. <laughs> is, that, is that actually on? Oh, I God. don't find that very funny. 
<laughs> you wrote it. I did not write it. I cannot you even sung remember it. doing that, actually. Can you not? No, I think we must have been drunk. But I'm quite pleased we did, actually. Yeah. Well, you probably were drunk, because I think we were in a hotel in Nottingham the first time we met. Uh, yes. Do you put that in your repertoire, by the way, that little jingle? Yeah, we do that every night. It's yeah. Yeah. every night on the 26th <laughs> state tour. Yeah. Who is your audience? Because I've been to that El Devo once or twice, mm. and um, th- there's two kind of groups. There's, there's those with the HRT patches, and then there's young girls <laughs> who think you're delicious. Where yeah. do you sit in that? Um, we prefer the younger. No, we we uh, we like all our audiences, obviously. Um, but no, we we've actually been getting quite a lot of younger people nowadays. Um, lots of sort of girls from about the age of seven um, up until the age of eighty-five, really, um, and lots of young couples, lots of sort of thirty-something couples. Um, so no, everyone really. And of course, you got the new member in the band, and is that all working well? Any arguments you want to tell me about? Any headlines we can make for the Sun newspaper? He's pretty. He's actually pretty easy to get along with. Thanks, Jules. Um, Thanks. Uh, he's much easier than the last one, yeah. who, who we had to get rid of, obviously. Um, but no, well, He's, he's a nice lad and he's a better singer as well mm. so perfect. you see the good thing about your group is because it was that G4 for a while wasn't there yes. you haven't got the fat one that everybody laughs at which is really good thank you very much thanks that's, that's well, there, is, there is a space for a fifth member Alex yeah. no well, I, I, let me just tell you a secret yes. Alex we've got a uh, mm-hmm. naked shoot with gay times in about eight days time so wow. we've been down the gym quite a lot really uh, and we're all looking pretty pretty good right now I well, wish you were here I would need a, I'd have to do the centrefold of that you see in the middle page so that the staple could cover something. <laughs> Who's got the best body out of the four of you f- so the ladies can Google? I think Hump's the sort of beefiest, that's for sure. So the ladies can what? I'm, Google. As, you, as we speak, I'm feeling his pectoral muscles. Very nice. Yeah. Is yes. anything happening? Uh, not much, no. Okay. There's, there's not much reaction on my behalf. <laughs> oh, right. really Good. Well, at least we've got something straight. <laughs> there's nothing like, um, you know, taking your clothes off as an incentive to uh, mm. to get in shape. And vanity is a very strong thing. Mm. The last so. time I did it, somebody thought I was modelling for scatter cushions. <laughs> <laughs> and door knockers as well. I don't know what they meant. Uh, listen, me. boys, I always love getting you on. You're a tremendous group. And joking aside, you've got four amazing voices that just fit perfectly. And that kismet doesn't happen very often. That's why you're here years and years later. How long Thank have you been you. together? Is it like three or four years we've known each other? Yeah, it's coming up to four years now. Good um, lord. So we've got another 17 to go. To think I'm still in work as well, it's a miracle. Well, Flaming I'm miracle. still on the radio as well. It is, it is one of those things, but you know, it's part of the community service. I only came in for a car sticker here, and look, I'm still on. <laughs> uh, this new album's called Together. It's out now, everybody can get it? They can, yeah. It's uh, every, every normal place, iTunes, Amazon, all those Very places. Nice. Boys, good to talk to you. Ollie, Stephen, Jules and Humphrey. Ah, oh, Blake. Nice to talk to you, boys. Thanks, Thanks mate. Hey, cheers, mate.